London Muslim Mosque Community Support Program. The uh, Community Support Program started um, years ago, even before my time. Um, it was limited to um, helping people overseas at the time. The objective is to help others, so that never changed, like the, the purpose has never changed. But the ways to help uh, people um, has evolved. That was the innovation part, is how can we make this program meaningful? Uh, you can only do so much on welfare, disability, etc. Sometimes it can be enough to just pay the rent. So how are these people going to feed themselves and their children? Yes, the food bank exists and other excellent options are available as well. But these options can provide very limited variety. My relationship with the mosque first began over a decade ago. I was a member of the board of the Sydney's community. The difference between what the mosque was like back then and what it is now, it's day and night. Uh, when I first joined the mosque, we had four employees and only two were full-time. It evolved into something else where people expressed that, hey, we're giving you the money because we're interested in helping people locally. Uh, but the mosque at the time didn't have the infrastructure, didn't have the employees to deal with that. So with the, with the hiring of staff and having more structure, and, and the mosque has been able to establish that through an application process. And, and that process determines you know, where the gap is and then provide the help that is needed. Now we have 114 employees and are constantly growing and expanding. We were able to help during COVID those who got stranded in Canada. Uh, international students, even visitors who are just here with all airports closing everywhere in the world. These people were, you know, got caught in this situation uh, and we were able to help them through that fund. What is important for people to realize is this program is offered by the Muslim community to help the community here in London. This is not um, it's strictly for Muslims, you know, you have the need, tell us about the need. If something we don't help already, we will look at it and say, can we actually help this person? So there's no set of rules. I don't consider myself coming to work every day because I know it's a cliche that they say, well, if you are following your passion and you do what, what you like, you don't have to work one day in your life. But, but it's true for me. That's what drives me. Um, it's not, you know, it's not a job. It's not like a, a nine to five job. It's, it, it's a passion. And the passion is to help others. Every minute you're in your office and the people you meet, the people that you help, just make your life, uh, you know, uh, worth it, basically. You're living for a cause, you're living for a purpose. So what drives us is, is the passion to help others. And, and any day you go home feeling good about that is a bonus.